Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about literal equations, and we're going to solve each equation for the indicated variable. So if I was given this equation, g equals ca, and I, I needed to solve that for the variable a, okay? So if I need to solve that for a, I'm going to rewrite my equation, g equals ca here, okay? Then I need to get a by itself. Well, there's multiplication going on between the c and the a. So opposite multiplication is division. I'm going to divide both sides by C. What that does is it eliminates a C on the, on the right, giving me just an A by itself. And then I have a G over a C on the left. A is already isolated. Fantastic. That's what I was looking for. I can rewrite this to have A come first. So I'll put the A first here. And I'm left with G over C. I'm going to put that on the right. It's the same thing, just A coming first. It looks nicer. And now I have my final answer. I have A isolated. And that is equal to g over c. Pretty simple. So let's recap here. We have g equals c times a, and we need to solve that for a. I divided a, or I rewrote the equation, then I divided c to both sides, because c, uh, c a is c times a. And the opposite of that is division, divided by c to both sides. Leave me with g over c equals a. a is isolated. It's by itself already. So I rewrote it to have a come first, because that looks nicer and cleaner. And so our final answer here is A equals G over C.